he, in fact, has asked us to pursue a very ambitious sector-wide program to improve population health outcomes using the Basic Healthcare Provision Fund as a basis for reviving our primary healthcare system, working with state governments and community leaders, traditional leaders, to ensure that Nigerians get better quality services to deal with the issues that bother them, whether it's malaria, whether it's immunization, maternal and child health, reproductive health. Those are elements that have direct bearings on the health and well-being of Nigerians with the state governments and with our development partners. So that sector-wide program is on the way. The second item is to unlock the value chain in the healthcare space. As the President has also approved an initiative, presidential initiative, to unlock the healthcare value chain. That will help drive the medical industrialization agenda. And thirdly, directed us to design social action fund, a way of reaching communities so that we trust them, we empower them, we support them to solve the, the issues that are very simple that are afflicting many of our people in the grassroots. That is complementing other efforts of government, of course, in terms of alleviating the pain that is in parts of our country. We are absolutely excited to partner with the government of Nigeria. Uh, the Renewed Hope uh, uh, campaign and commitment um, is exciting global partners uh, to say how do we align with the government. I do like the uh, president's uh, direction on talking less and doing more uh, and getting to action. Uh, so our hope is that we will be a committed partner uh, to supporting uh, the federal as well as state governments and communities uh, to deliver health for all. Thank you.